Hey everyone, it's the Yankee in Siberia telling you the truth about life in Russia. So I'm here at the airport in Omsk. And as the title says, I'm moving from Omsk to Moscow. So let's go. So with a city of a million people, it's really surprising how small the Omsk airport really is. Uh, there's two floors. Well, I was downstairs and now I'm upstairs waiting for my flight. And this is the whole airport. There's, there's only two terminals here and right now just waiting for my flight and when the airplane does arrive instead of actually being attached to the airport we will go outside goes on a little trolley and is taken to the airplane that way I just landed here in Moscow. Uh, this is actually my sixth time here in Moscow from traveling between America and Omsk before, but this will be the first time I actually leave the airport. So let's see what's outside the airport. first impressions after being in here in Moscow f for a couple of days is just how big the city really is. It is definitely much bigger than Omsk was. The buildings are the size of the city and the buildings are absolutely much bigger. It's also interesting to see how green the city really is. I'm just a little bit away from my apartment doing some exploring and I found this park that's right here in the city and it's just a big wooded area. There are little playgrounds for children and ping pong tables, basketball courts. There aren't any rides in this park like in the park by me in Omsk, but it's a, a really big wooded area that's really beautiful and I really enjoy walking around here. been here a week and right now I am in the middle of Red Square. I got the famous St. Basil's Theater be Cathedral behind me. So it's been a really interesting first week. I've got uh, been doing a little moving around using the metro for the first time. So the reason why I ended up coming here to Moscow and left Siberia was uh, I just ended up leaving my company and because Omsk really didn't have any big English schools so there was really uh, not enough work there so I started looking for work and found some work here in Moscow so that is why I'm now here and I'm really looking forward to my life here in Moscow now. I live very close to Red Square. Uh, if there's anything that you want to know about life here in Moscow, just let me know in the comments below. And I will try to answer as many questions as I possibly can um, and make videos about any topics that are interesting to you. Don't forget to like this video if you like it and make sure to subscribe to check out more videos about life here in Moscow now. So until next time, peace out Mother Russia.